Hi everybody, it's Joe Krug from ThinSuite. In this video, we're covering the play icon with a page load page trigger. We're going to be looping this Lottie icon of a play when the user loads the page. It doesn't have anything to do with scrolling into view or hover or click or anything. It's just gonna happen. So we can preview this and we'll see that this icon is playing and looping. It's not going to loop and loop and loop and loop. It's going to delay a little bit before it reloops. And the reason for this is to not be as in your face. It is getting the user's attention. It's a nice effect and it's not over the top. Let's go and see how this works with interactions. Note that we are not using the default Lottie animation loop. And if we were to do this, it would be very fast. Still looks good, but maybe we want a little bit of delay here. We don't want it to happen. Loop and loop and loop and loop. So let's uncheck this and let's go into interactions. Here we have a page trigger, page load set up, and we have our play load when page starts loading. And when we click through on this, we'll see that the first action is a delay of two seconds with the Lottie icon at 0%. And then for one second, it's going to go from zero to 98%. And we'll see that this is simply creating the Lottie icon animation one time through. You can customize this value, set it to a duration of two seconds, set it to different stages in the Lottie animation. Uh, you can do whatever here. There's a lot of steps here. You can be creative here and do something cool. But for simplicity, we're going to do a simple zero to 98, and we're going to set that on a loop so that the user can get their attention on that video and click play. That is how you implement a play icon with a page load, page trigger. That's effing sweet.